Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Carter Me and Lisa, and we're back with another video. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Before we even get started, go ahead and click that subscribe button, join the family, so you can be inspired, motivated, and uplifted. I mean, like, who doesn't want to be inspired, motivated, and uplifted? Like, come on. Nobody can be you better than you can be you, so why not be you? the best way all right so as you probably seen from the title today we are going to be showing how to protect your vachetta leather specifically this is um common with louis vuitton bags although they have been rolling out some you know treated vachetta vachetta leather uh they still have their other ones that are not and i know that this is not for everybody um, so please understand that like when you make this decision to do this, it is a choice. Okay. But I'm showing my experience. So yeah, I'm going to show you the process and then I'm going to come back on screen and tell you guys, um, like how it went for me. Okay. so I showed my process basically I had the apple guard spray that I got off of Amazon and I will link it down below um, and I just followed the instructions on the spray bottle I left it sitting for like about an hour before I moved it um, I think it says 30 minutes Hold on, let me check it says to let it dry for 30 minutes um, I'm pretty sure I left mine for about an hour and then I did not put my Pachette Matisse back in the box after spraying it. I left it out because um, I saw online that it's better to leave your items that have Vachetta out for at least a few days to allow it to have a more even patina situation going on. Um, I heard that from Minnie, who is Minx for All on YouTube. I love her videos. You should check her out. She's really amazing. She's very well-versed um, on more than just one fashion house um i'm a louis vuitton girl so <laughs> i can't speak on other fashion houses but she uh did talk about that so i've had mine actually sitting out she does keep hers in a dust bag but i pretty much leave mine out i just kind of um, leave them in a safe area they're not in direct sunlight or anything like that after i sprayed the apple guard on there i did check on my bag and i haven't had any stains on there from the spray it does say to keep about six to nine inches between you when you're spraying and to go in a swipe like motion you know 
Yeah, I know it's wipe, but we're saying swipe because we're swiping. Swiping, no swiping. Right? So I did that. Um, it was really, really, really easy to do. Uh, I would definitely recommend doing it, but also just understand you are taking a choice and a chance. I personally have not had a bad experience with it, but some people have had bad experiences. I haven't seen anyone personally who uh, had an issue with the Apple Guard or Garde or however you pronounce it. But <laughs> um, other brands they have, so just make sure if you're going to treat your leather for whatever reason that you do your research naturally this is not designed to keep the vachetta from patina i actually like that it patinas over time this was more so that if i wear my bag out and it starts to rain it's less likely to stain my bag or if i were to spill something my daughter decided to be the little human that she is with dirty hands and touch my bag that it would be okay so definitely it gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Super easy to use, very clear instructions. Also, please note, um, I did not cover my bag. A lot of people like to kind of like put paper towel around. Um, and I think I said that earlier on in the video, but just in case I want to reiterate uh, it here, <laughs> that you can cover the bag. It doesn't make a difference. It's treated canvas around it. So you can just wipe it down. I use water wipes. Um, because they're like 99.9% .9 water. So it's actually really good to wipe your bags down anyway with it. So I have water wipes just for that purpose. Uh, you can get that at Target or Amazon or whatnot. I'll try to find it and link it down below. So after I sprayed it, I just wiped it down with the water wipe. I didn't find it necessary to waste a bunch of paper towels just because I was spraying those simple parts of the bag. But yes, that is how I treated my Bichetta leather. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. If there's anything you want to know about what made me do it, how to do it, anything like that, go ahead and comment down below. Let me know what else you want to see. If this video was helpful and slash or you liked it, be sure to give me a thumbs up. And you've made it this far. So what are you waiting on? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Join my family. You've made it this far. We've got some videos for you to watch. Like, come on. Be inspired, motivated, and uplifted. You can follow me at Cardi Melissa on all social media, just like it is here on YouTube. And y'all know how this goes. Until next time, y'all. Peace.